I have Asperger's syndrome. It's difficult. Pen. I don't like this. I don't like pens. People clicking pens. I have sensitivity to noise. And motion. And sounds. Some people say that Asperger's and autism means that you have super abilities. I think that what they mean is that we have better hearing. We may have stronger hearing. We can hear more. We can feel more. We can see more. I can hear a lot more than maybe you could. Two rooms away, the TV is on volume. And the volume is maybe like a, a 20 on the TV. But to me, a room and a half away, it's like turn the volume up to 50 when the TV is on 20. It's difficult to cope with. When I watch movies on DVD, I have to use a portable DVD player because, and, and headphones. Headphones that block out the noise of outside noise, but also so that I can hear the sounds and the audio a lot more clearer and better. I have some sensory issues with hearing and with touch and with sight I actually can't see very well I don't think that's related to my Asperger's or autism though hmm. I got glasses in high school I'm 22 now some say I don't look like I'm 22 because I don't dress like a 22-year-old. You tell me, tell me viewers, how is a 22-year-old supposed to dress? What are they supposed to dress in? Fancy boots that are impractical and they're not waterproof and they have weird looking heels on them and they have too much material or fabric at the Achilles tendon area and the heel and, and uh, the middle of the top of the foot, there's too much fabric. And so when you, you move your foot and your leg and you use the muscles in your feet, the fabric bends and pushes pressure against my feet. I don't like that. It's a texture and a tactile thing.